Hey everyone and welcome back to Serena's Toy Room. Today I have a new doll to share with you guys. It is Long Lux Rapunzel. She is very pretty. I don't really buy dolls from Walmart anymore because they just don't really have anything interesting anymore. But I did spot this in the clearance section. Clearance. It wasn't really that much of a clearance price. It was $17. I think the regular price is around $24.99. So it was a little bit cheaper and it was fairly priced. My mom treated us today, the siblings and I, to a toy, so I picked this up. And I thought it was nice, so why not? Let's get on with the packaging so I can open it. Dial her hair. She's quite lovely. I really like her dress too. And there's an image of Rapunzel and a picture of her tower. And there's pictures of Rapunzel on this side too. And Maximus. Hasbro, Disney Princess, Rapunzel's long looks. Age 3 plus. Disney Princess, Rapunzel's Long Lux. Saw Rapunzel's Long Hair. There's a girl playing with Rapunzel and a beautiful image of the doll. Includes doll, outfit, tiara, hair clip, hair extension, brush, and pair of shoes. Brush, clip, wear, and share. Also, look for Belle's Long Lux. I remember seeing that when these dolls came out and I thought she was really pretty. But I don't really think I saw Rapunzel in stores, but I remember seeing Belle and I thought Belle was really nice. So, let's open up Rapunzel and give her a closer look. Here's Rapunzel out of the box and she's so pretty. She has the older Hasbro face before they changed it recently because this is one of the first Hasbro princess lines. The only Hasbro Disney princess dolls they have are the original and updated basic Ariel dolls. So I don't have any of the other princesses. So this is my first non-Ariel princess doll. I think she's quite nice. She has the old face, really thick black eyelashes and faint brown shadow. And she has really cute rosy cheeks and freckles and natural pink lips. Her hair is long and blonde and goes down to her feet, which is nice because some Rapunzel dolls have kind of done shortcuts to save money and made Rapunzel's hair like about down to here. But I definitely appreciate when companies make her hair floor length. The longer the hair on Rapunzel dolls, the better because it's more accurate. I love the long hair. Rapunzel's like totally meant to be a doll because she just has this beautiful long hair and that's partially the reason why I love collecting Rapunzel dolls because the more hair a doll has the better because I love long hair dolls. She's really cute and she has this purple translucent tiara which looks really reminiscent to the one she wears in the movie. Her dress is so pretty. The top part is made of like a purple tulle and a darker purple tulle on the sleeves that you see through as you can see. Really nice white frilly detailing around the bottom of the sleeves and around the waist piece as you can see here. She has a printed on corset. I do wish the ribbons in the corset were real ribbon, just like the little bow that's on her chest right there, but that's alright. And the skirt is my favorite part of the dress. It's so beautiful and it's made of a really nice thick fabric and I love the embroidered details. That's what really stood out to me about the Belle version when I saw her originally. I really loved the embroidered details and these little flowers and stuff. And then she has these really cute purple flats. And they are flats, not heels. Her feet are chest arched up as if she was wearing heels. She comes with a purple mirror slash comb. I think it's cool how it's double-sided. And I appreciate that she does come with a brush because she needs it, of course. She's Rapunzel. And she has a little hair extension, which is purple with some tinsel in it. And a little magic flower in yellow at the clip part and this little plastic flower clip that clips into her hair and it can also be worn by the owner as well. Here are the hair accessories in her hair. They are very cute. The little um, flower hair clip is made out of quite a flimsy plastic and it's kind of hard to clasp but once it's in there it's good to go. And this one is fine. It's made of a harder plastic so it's good. Her hair is long in nylon and it feels very reminiscent to the Disney Store Rapunzel nylon. So I wonder if they use the same hair. It feels quite nice. And once it's washed and gets all of the little crimps out from being in the package, I'm sure she'll be wonderful. Alright everyone, thank you for watching my review on Long Lux Rapunzel. Tell me what you guys think of her down in the comments. And until next time, comment, rate, subscribe, and see you in the next video. Bye guys! Hey guys, just one more thing before I go. I want to thank you guys for over 6,000 subscribers. I am so grateful and thank you guys so much for getting me to this point. And um, yeah, I just wanted to say that because I am very thankful. So um, yeah, bye.